hot. Sussex's marriage is on the verge of collapse as their popularity plummets, Duke blames on Meg. Sussex's popularity plummets as Meghan blamed for ruining young fun Harry. Meghan Markle's popularity has taken a hit, claims royal expert, as the Duchess is blamed by the British public for creating a woke and weird version of Prince Harry. A royal expert has said that the popularity of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex has absolutely plummeted in the UK since their decision to depart the royal family. Speaking to GB News about the future of the monarchy, Ingrid Seward said the British public blames Meghan Markle for taking Harry away, and their actions have taken the heat off Prince Andrew's upcoming lawsuit. Speaking to host Alex Phillips, Ingrid Seward said, Meghan does deflect because people in this country having loved her once, now don't seem to like her at all and they blame her for taking Harry away from all of us. Harry was just this young, fun prince that everyone could relate to and now he's gone all woke and weird. So I think their popularity has absolutely plummeted and I suppose in a way, they have kind of taken the heat of Prince Andrew. Before leaving the royal family, Prince Harry was usually ranked as the most popular member of the royal family. According to YouGov polls, the prince is now regarded as the 14th most popular member, with Meghan Markle falling at 13th. Lesser known members of the family such as Princess Anne and Prince Edward are currently ranked higher than the Sussexes. The couple decided to leave the royal family in January 2020, in a shock announcement that reportedly blindsided certain members of the monarchy. After struggling to deal with intense media scrutiny, and internal rifts within Buckingham Palace, the Sussexes stated their desire to step down from their roles and relocate to California. Since then, the couple have gone on to establish their own non-profit foundation Artuel, and have signed a number of lucrative deals with streaming giants, Netflix and Spotify. In March, they sat down for an explosive tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey, where they criticized the royal family and spoke of their difficult relationship with Buckingham Palace. Allegations included Palace aides ignoring Meghan's mental health, refusing to intervene with the tabloid press, and most damagingly, that an unnamed member of the family had queried how dark their unborn son would be. Prince Harry also said he felt really let down by Prince Charles and that his relationship with William could be defined as space. This interview, along with subsequent interviews conducted by Prince Harry, caused a PR crisis for the royal family and divided opinions amongst the British public. The couple came under criticism for airing the Oprah interview whilst the Duke of Edinburgh was gravely ill. He died a month after the interview was broadcasted on ITV. Prince Harry and Meghan have also faced criticism for their lucrative deals with Netflix, which will see the couple earn £100 million to fund their Californian lifestyle. The Duke is also working on his upcoming memoir, which threatens to reveal more intimate details about their relationship with the royal family. Whilst Prince Harry has returned to the UK on two occasions since departing the monarchy, Meghan Markle has remained in California. She has not seen her royal in-laws since the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic, and has no plans to return at present. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle may have attained the privacy they wanted thanks to Megxit, but one royal commentator pointed out that they have actually isolated themselves now more than ever and trapped themselves with the pressure to do good. The Duke of Sussex told Oprah Winfrey in March that he left his life as a working royal because he felt trapped in the institution. He even went as far as to suggest that his brother Prince William feels the same way although he just has not realized it yet. But royal expert Duncan Larkham said the couple's decisions and plans have backfired. As their popularity dwindles, so do their plans to do good and thus far, they have only received criticism.